Comparing and ordering decimals. We compare whole numbers all the time. Which of your friends is the oldest? Who got the most candy for Halloween? Who has the highest grade on a test? Sometimes we need to compare decimals too. Who earned more money at her summer job? Which baseball player has the highest batting average? To compare decimals, write them one below the other with decimal points lined up. Then compare every single digit of each number starting at the left. For example, Jean finished a race in 3.24 minutes and Stacy finished the same race in 3.19 minutes. Who finished the race faster? Line up the numbers you need to compare. Start on the left. Both start with the same number, 3, so move on to the next digit. The next digits are 2 and 1. 2 is bigger than 1, so 3.24 is bigger than 3.19. So, Stacy finished the race faster. You can use this same approach to compare any number of decimals and put them in order. Take a look at this example. Jerome, Kayla, and Lev are running laps in gym class. Jerome ran 25.6 laps. Kayla ran 25.92 laps and Lev ran 25.901 laps. Who ran the most laps? Who ran the least? Let's line up the numbers just like we did in the last problem. If it helps you, add zeros to the right of the first two numbers until all three numbers have the same number of digits. We can do this because adding zeros after the decimal point does not change the value of a number. 25.6 is the same as 25.60 or 25.60. 600. In each case, we have two tens, five ones, and six tenths. Here's how we add zeros to the numbers in this question. Okay, now let's compare. The first and second digits of all three numbers are the same. Let's look at the next digit, the tenths place right after the decimal point. 6 is less than 9, so we know that Jerome ran less than either Kayla or Lev. But since Kayla and Lev's numbers both have a 9 in the tenths place, we have to compare the next digit, the hundredths. 2 is bigger than 0, so Kayla ran the most laps, followed by Lev and then Jerome. Here is what you have learned so far.